Hello everyone, you are welcome to iStrategy family. This is Matthew, an account manager at iStrategy. We are the manufacturer of 2G, 3G, 4G GPS trackers and 4G wireless routers since 2015. We are based in Shenzhen, China. Today, we're going to show you how to do the testing of our iStarTech fuel sensor and VT100 GPS tracker at your office before you could make an actual installation in your vehicle. Step one is about tools preparation. We need one laptop, one USB cable for online configurations, one power supply, 12 voltage or 24 voltage, VT100 or VT100L GPS tracker, a ultrasonic fuel sensor, coupling agent, one bottle of water or any other suitable container with a flat cover, and one mobile phone with UL212 fuel up. Step two is about cleaning and applying coupling agent. First clean the probe very well and clean the top of the bottle of water and then apply coupling agent. Step three is about wires connection with iStartic GPS tracker. Connect green wire from the fuel sensor to the orange wire from GPS tracker. Connect the black wire from fuel sensor to the black wire of GPS tracker. Connect the red wire from fuel sensor to red wire of GPS tracker. And connect black and the red wire from power supply to the black and the red wire from both fuel sensor and GPS tracker. After powering on the device, the probe will have red light flashing. And note that fuel sensor green wire cannot be connected to 12 voltage or 24 voltage, otherwise it will burn the device. Step four is about checking the LED light of the probe. Once you take the bottle and place it over the probe, you wait a moment to get the signal. And then you can check if the LED light is green. When it's green, it means that the signal strength is okay. Step five is about parameter editor configurations. After you do the connections, connect the tracker to your laptop via USB cable. Open parameter editor. Choose the right COM port. Click open. It will show connected at your left side downwards. Click GPRS. Click read. 
you can set APN IP port enable GPRS mode as TCP and set time interval then click write click interface and set input mode we can set input 1 or input 2 as analog input if we are using input 1 which is white while of tracker connected to green wall of fear sensor we could set input 1 as AD input and if we are using input 2 which is orange while from tracker connected to green wall of fear sensor we can set input 2 as AD input since we are using orange wire connected to green wire fuel sensor, we will have to set input 2 as AD input. For tank, you could name as you want. And for sensor type, you have to choose ultrasonic 250 centimeter. And for source, you have to choose AD2. And click right. Go back to info click write all and close step 6 is about checking com2 after configurations you need to open com2 check if the tracker is able to read the ultrasonic sensor data open com2 Choose the right COM port. Choose 115200 and select hex to ASC2 and click open. And it will start reading data from GPS tracker. Close and check the data this is sending GPRS data you can see this is AD1 and this is AD2 if you look at the protocols iStratic protocols you will find out AD1 and AD2. We connected our fuel sensor on AD2, meaning that this is AD2 data. Here in COM2, we can find it 0021. If you check Astratec protocols, you could find out how to do calculations to get the height of the remaining fuel volume and also remaining fuel volume in liters. Thank you so much. Last step is about checking signal strength data through our mobile app. You log in into mobile app UL212 fuel and search for the device this is ul212 fuel and click connect when it's connected you go back 
and the data details will be displayed. And once you notice that real time height is equal to smooth height or nearly the same, and also you check signal strength, which must be greater than 60. Then it means that our ultrasonic field sensor signal strength is okay for installation. Thank you so much. It was our pleasure to have you today. For more information, you may visit our official website www.istratech.com Thank you for watching. See you next time. Shenzhen iStar Tech Technology Company Limited is an enterprise engaged in research, development, manufacturing, and sale of IoT products. Since its inception in 2015, iStar Tech has established strategic partnerships with a number of internationally renowned IT enterprises with the capability of rapidly mastering and accessing global leading edge to make technological breakthroughs and facilitate product innovations. iStar Tech products, including 2G, 3G, 4G, MB, LoRa, GPS Tracker, and 4G Router, provision of services and products, integrating both hardware and software platforms, as well as customized specialty services, is one of our major competitive edges. With quality being its top priority, iStar Tech targets to offer IoT equipment with stable and enduring performances. Our mission, dedicated to provision of long-term stable running IoT devices. Our R&D team, iStar Tech engineers with six years industry experience, serving hundreds of clients worldwide. Our sales team consists of eight technical sales with rich experience in offering multi-language pre-sales and after-sales services. Our production capability with our partner factories, 15 high-speed SMT lines and our assembly lines, ensuring monthly production of 40,000 pieces of quality trackers. Our quality control, 12 times of quality inspections, 36 hours aging testing, tracker qualified rate at high level of 99.5%. Our services, two days quick sample delivery, six hours fast technical response, 12 months warranty. We look forward to establishing long-term relationships, achieve win-win cooperation. GPS checker and 4G wireless router. What?